This morning we are hearing from a local mother in desperate need of a special medical helmet for her son. Our producer Haley Power spoke to a specialist about why cranial helmets are so important and introduces us to the family looking for answers. I truly don't understand how um, a child's skull is cosmetic. Miranda Hernandez is at a standstill right now with her Medicaid insurance after they continue to deny coverage for a cranial helmet for her son Ezekiel. Hernandez saying her insurance claims the need for the helmet is cosmetic. Clinical director of the UT Health San Antonio Cranial Remolding Program, Darren Poitivan, says the American Board of Certification recognizes the word cosmetic is when you take something and beautify it. But he says cranial helmets are much more than that. We're not beautifying something. We're taking something that's abnormal and bringing it back into a normal, normalcy. In Ezekiel's case, he has a condition called torticollis, which means the muscle in his neck are tight, causing him to not be able to move his head properly. This has led to another condition called plagiocephaly, which means the shape of his head is becoming flat. As much as I try to, you know, contact, you know, um, insurance they just won't help me, so I feel helpless, you know, that I can't help my own son. Poitivan says getting a baby into a cranial helmet is crucial. When a helmet is not used when needed, it can lead to vision issues, increased ear infections, and problems with the jaw. 80% of the, the, the skull grows in that first year. All this lower part takes about 10 years to develop. So we want to get all of this line so this follows. Poitivan recommends a baby getting into a helmet around four to six months old since the skull is not fused yet. As for Ezekiel, he turns one in September and a baby skull fuses at 18 months. You can read more about his story on KSAT.com. Haley Powers, KSAT 12 News. Hello, everybody. Stefania Jimenez here. Thank you so much for watching KSAT's YouTube channel. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.